Today I'm going to be working on my 2012 Chevy Equinox. I'm going to be removing the throttle body and cleaning it. It's pretty dirty. I will show you the steps for doing that. First off, you want to remove um, this cover, this uh, air intake. Um, there's, a, there's a bolt there. You want to remove the PCV hose. And then there's one more bolt down here that is attached to the hose that connects to the throttle body. All right, I've gone ahead and removed both bolts. Um, this, this hose, it just kind of snaps in, so you just kind of lightly wiggle and it will come, come right out there. And then there's two rubber grommets on the back, and you just pull up on those. And then the whole assembly just lift right out. First, when you're uh, Working with any electrical parts, um, go ahead and disconnect the battery terminal here. Alright, and there's the throttle body. You can tell um, without me taking it off that it's pretty dirty in there. There's a lot of carbon buildup. Um, I'm going to be cleaning that out. I've just got some CRC throttle body and intake cleaner. Um, should be pretty simple. There's four bolts. Just go ahead and remove those. Remove this. Um, remove these wires and it should just come right out. Alright, so as you can see again Pretty dirty, quite a bit of carbon buildup in there. Um, be cleaning her out and showing you what I got. So, give it a couple sprays right inside. Nothing crazy. And then we'll get a shop towel, soak that, and then wet it down. By spraying, you can see how much cleaner it's gotten here. Um, everything else is just kind of running down a downhill there. Um, but soak down the shop rag. I'm just going to clean it out, um, and I'll show you the final product. So you can see it's a lot cleaner now. Got rid of all that carbon in there. So now I'll just go ahead and put it back in. Um, I did put a little bit of oil just around that o-ring um, to seal it up. Um, I am reusing the old o-ring. I know that's not really recommended, but I've seen a lot of people do it and no issues. Put it back on, um, just reverse process. Um, four bolts, don't tighten them very tight. Um, and then slip this on and then slip the little red, the little red tab that slips down is soon as it latches there. Go ahead, put my air intake back on, um, hose here, hose there, two grommets, and then make sure that this hose is clipped back in too. Um, if you forget to put that on, it can cause you quite a bit of trouble. And then turn your battery back on and you should be ready to roll.